Let me go to bed. I'm fucking drunk. Oh my god, baby girl. Baby girl. Baby girl. Baby girl. Where'd you come from? Party motherfucking bitch. Oh god. She's so upset. She can't do it. She's trying to figure it out. I'm doing it. Y'all, so it has come to a conclusion that the best way, am, am I lying? The best way to fuck is with the TV on. You wanna know why? Because let me tell you something. If all the lights is turned on, right, and I'm fucking, and I see a pimple on the nigga face, it distracts me from coming. Because now, I wanna pop the pimple, and I can't focus, now I can't focus at all. Now, when it's too dark, and all the lights is off now, now I'm scared. Cause I'm scared of the dark, and you know you start seeing monsters when it's too dark and shit, bitch. I, oh, bitch, I'm scared. I wanna get out of here. Turn the motherfucking lights off. I can't fuck like this. Now when the TV is on, it's like you know when the club, when the club with that blue light is on, everybody look beautiful. Everybody look beautiful. That's the type. You know that you, you look beautiful when the TV light is on. So that's how I want to fuck with the TV on. And and that's the best way to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I like. What's poppin' everybody? It's your girl Cardi B. I try to get a little cute for y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm putting my little Aldo earrings on and shit. Um, so we're gonna pretend like this is an AMA award. And um, I wanna say thank you everybody for voting for me for this AMA award. I'm so grateful that I won this AMA award uh, a couple of days ago. I know I won a Soul Chain Award and I'm very thankful for that. I'm sorry to my fans that I've really been off the scene. I've been busy every fucking night, every motherfucking day in the studio. I haven't been able to motherfucking, you know, put a nice wig on, uh, wax my mustache, even do my nails, my fucking eyebrows is fucked up. So, you know, I've been a little bit off the scene and everything because I've just been a little bit off, just focusing so I could deliver some good old music for y'all 2020 and like i said thank you so much um and just remember brush your teeth brush your tongue eat carrots for your motherfucking vision don't be lazy put lotion and baby oil right after you get out the shower and i love you bye hold on you something if your friends start acting different when your nigga come around you need to cut that bitch off i will tell you to beat her ass right there and then but i don't want y'all motherfuckers saying that i'm promoting violence and shit like you know what the type of shit that i hate i hate when a nigga come around right and a bitch want to change her voice her tone and shit trying to talk all cute you're trying to act all delicate talking about like oh my god are you serious bitch why are you talking like that bitch your voice is wild deep like fucking pop smoke all of a sudden you motherfucking talking like kim kardashian stop fucking playing or when she trying to make you fucking look stupid like you ask her a question like oh my god remember that time that we almost drowned and she go like no i don't remember what are you talking about bitch why you fucking trying to make me look fucking stupid bitch i will whip your motherfucking ass i will ask her right there and then like say bitch what are you talking about like that happened last week what are you talking about you remember why are you talking like that like, stop playing with me bitch but i don't got friends like that so i can't relate all right, y'all, so let me talk to y'all, right? Because a lot of you bitches talking about tricking and hoeing. But the question is, what level is your trick on? Because there's levels to this shit. Now, the first level, if your trick is paying for your nails and your hair done, giving you 200, that's first level tricking. Second level tricking is when a nigga's buying you a Chanel purse. He bought your surgery in the Colombias and the Dominican Republic. He paid for your $2,000, $3,000 rent in your condo. That's second level. Now the third level is when a nigga's buying you Rolex, he bought you a little Mercedes, bitch. He bought you a little diamond chain. That's the third level. Fourth level is when a nigga bought you a business. Now, bitch, nigga that done bought you a salon or a spa, you on the fourth level. Now the fifth level is when you marry an A-Rap. Bitch, you that done marry a nigga that own a gas station. Congratulations, bitch. You own oils in the Pakistan, bitch. Ha! It's levels to this shit. What up, y'all? So my Fashion Nova collection, my second Fashion Nova collection just dropped. I hope you females enjoy it. I hope you fellas buy it for um, your girlfriend, your side bitches, your baby mamas, your mamas, your auntie, your sisters. I don't fucking know. These are one of my pieces, and this right here, you could separate it down so you could wear it, so you could look like, I don't know, 
Let's bloody. Thank you so much, everybody, for your support. I'm late as fuck to my motherfucking party. So I'll talk to y'all later. Let me, let me.